The idea of, of doing Farm 300 was seeing where we're at compared to other producers and just reinforcing are we on the right track and what changes we need to make. Two years ago we started a project um, which we've been slowly poking away at and we just wanted some sort of reassurance of what we were doing, that we were heading in the right direction. We've been able to do that with um, Farm 300, but we've been able to do it with a group of people that um, you know, like-minded, um, have good ideas, and we've been able to you know, debate, I suppose, to a certain degree, the goods and the bads. The approach is at Dunkel Pastoral is that they want every animal to be productive and, and producing them something every year. The big waste at times can be ewes that aren't, aren't in lamb uh, or yeah, dry animals that you're trying to, trying to grow out and the ewe lambs are the major ones there. On a lot of enterprises they're not lambing until they're 24 months of age and, and they're trying to push the system a little bit and lamb them at 14 months of age and they're getting good, really good results. The big area that Dunkeld are wanting to improve is their pasture productivity. They're low stockers at the moment and they're limited by the, uh, the fertility of their pastures and, and the species in their pastures and that's been an area that we've tried to, tried to address within the Farm 300 program is, is trying to maximise the pasture production so we can really increase stocking rates. One of the biggest things has been looking after your pasture drought lots and, and feeding lots um, and able to spell pasture and especially next year I think we'll end up with um, better utilisation of our assets to, to utilise our pasture and, and look after it for the long term so that we're not you know, going in and replanting new pastures every six or eight years but actually getting 15, 20 years out of a pasture system and to look after it and, be, and benefit the whole, the whole system. Over the next two years we've, we've planned to um, plant 160,000 trees on Dunkel Pastoral. So I'd like to think that we'd have a lot more shelter belts, a lot more ecosystems in place, um, for want of a better word. More rivers fenced and more creek lines looked after. I'd like to think that we'd, um, we'd be humming a bit better as far as um, now, number of lambs weaned per hectare, I think um, we're certainly on the right track for that. Farm 300 shown or reinforced the fact that you can reduce your greenhouse gas emissions, you can increase profitability and you can actually make a better farm. If you asked me six or seven months ago, could it be possible, I would have gone no, um, I don't think so. But now that it's been explained to us, it, it just makes perfect sense. All the little one percenters, whether it's genetics, whether it's feeding ewe lambs, whether it's you know, trial feeding or feedlot feeding or drought lots or you know, adding more trees or better pastures, like you put all those little things together and they all add up and you're able to achieve you know, less greenhouse gas emissions and more profitability.